Finally, after two long years, we get to travel. We're going to South Korea this time and best of all, it's going to be a snowboarding trip, which is always super exciting and fun. This trip was organized by Singapore Ski and Snowboard Academy in partnership with EU Holidays. So a huge shout out to both these awesome companies. Now this tour isn't your typical tour group. We'll mostly be staying in the Gangwon province at the Yongpyeong Ski Resort. So no shopping in Seoul and no sightseeing, just 6 full days on the snowy mountains focusing on advancing our snow sport skills. However, we will be exploring some awesome food in the area, learning some of Korea's culture, and of course making some great friends and memories along the way. Alright, so we just arrived in Korea, um, got our PCR test done. I'm just waiting for our ride to the mountains. Yeah, but this is my first time out, so very surreal experience, but uh, yes, something familiar, snowboarding, that's going to be really fun and a lot more things planned out for us through this whole tour, so stay tuned for that. Alright guys, so we just got to the hotel. It was a really long journey to like travel by air, then bus and all that. Uh, but we're finally here. The hotel room looks pretty amazing. Um, got two beds. Obviously, I lost the scissors paper stone because Sean is getting the double bed. One, two, three! Oh, you didn't. oh, again, the double bit is mine. Anyway, more importantly, we have dinner. Dinner is delivered. Uh, where is it? Okay. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. I, I recognize this. Yeah, so, Kyojon, which is Korean fried chicken. Whoa, I love this. Mm. And then they got us pizza. Open, yeah, open. Right, right. Pizza first, pizza first. Review. Ready? Ooh. That looks very like fresh and like Yeah, it's tropical. like so, so like in your face. I thought cool. Yeah. Okay, All fried right. chicken, fried, fried chicken. chicken. Let's go. Our first Korean fried chicken. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh. Bro. Wow, they didn't they didn't oh. cheap out man. This is oh. I okay, like I, I really wasn't expecting anything from this. this. Deeper, eh. I wasn't expecting um a good meal from like takeaway, but yo! Oh. Ooh, the sound! Oh dude, it's so good! <laughs> I thought it would be stale, but it's damn crispy! Yeah. Oh mm. my god, look! Wow! This is so oily and juicy, eh! Wow! Alright, good morning guys! It's our first day, just going for our lunch now. Then we're gonna get the skiing and snowboarding started. Look at the size of that! Look! And the proportion of rice! So right after lunch, we got our rental gear and it was off to the slopes. Hey. Now as winter was nearing its end, we were blessed with a variety of different snow conditions. There were days when the spring brought out the sunny weather, which felt great to be outdoors. The snow was freshly groomed and it was the best time to get some speed in our runs. One of the great things about this tour was that local coaches like Snow Mama and Kamalita flew in with us to coach the beginners and intermediate riders. This really helped us progress way faster and it was also a lot of fun. Now by the fifth day, we were pretty confident with our skills and focused on just having loads of fun.
On the last day, we were given a huge surprise. There was powder everywhere and sadly, this was the last day of our snowboarding, but we still made the best of it. My biggest takeaway from this trip was learning to carve and really use my edges well. It gave me a real sense of progression and I can't wait to learn more and progress even further. Between our riding days, the Sing Ski Festival also held a fun competition. First up was the tube ride which everyone really enjoyed. Now I don't know who the real winners were but we were having way too much fun to even care. Next up was the ski and snowboard competition. Another great experience that was thanks to the organizers at the Sing Ski Festival. And of course, at night we received all our medals and prizes. Our tour group got one of the most medals for the sea and snowboarding competition, which was really great. At the end of the day, it was a great time. Everybody learned a lot. There was a lot of progression and everybody just had a great time. So like I said earlier, this tour was all about progressing your snow sport skills and that's exactly what we did. We captured some of the beginning moments of our fellow tour group mates, some of whom have never stepped on snow before, others who have some ski experience and others like us who are at the intermediate level. It was great to see everyone's progress at the end of the trip, learning a new sport and really enjoying themselves. Right, so this is what it's all about. This whole festival was catered to foreigners coming here. It's a festival for skiing and also trying to play other games. Like they got the Squid Games thing lined up for us. So it's going to be really cool. Let's go. All right, so first up in the games, we had the mini games that were played in the very popular Squid Games. Now, this was the first time I've ever done it in real life. So it was actually pretty exciting. Now, next up, we had the game where you had to trace out the shapes on these sugar honeycomb biscuits. Depending on what shape you get would determine how easy it is to win. Unfortunately, I wasn't that skilled in this game. Now next up, the very popular red light, green light, which everyone absolutely loves. In this game, people get called out if they are caught moving while the speaker is facing them. In the end, the finalists went on to the last game, which was the tug of war. Now unfortunately, our tour group did not win this game. But that didn't matter because we all had a lot of fun. So the night ended with a couple of performances, one of which was a cultural group who played popular K-drama songs on traditional instruments. Last of all, we were blown away by the performance of a K-pop cover dance group, ending the night off with a bang and of course some last minute photo takings. I'd like to thank Gangwon Province for organising this ski festival for us. On top of the snowboarding and skiing, the games and cultural performances really summed up our whole experience here in Korea. After several days in Korea, finally, we are going to get some barbecue. Mmm, quite off the grill is really good. Today is by far the snowiest day we've had here in Korea. Well, 